Alright, hey, what's up guys, AA12 here, and welcome back to another Minecraft Pocket Edition video. Today I have something extremely awesome for you guys today, something that we have done in the past, but I honestly do believe that it is the perfect time to re-showcase this one more time. But before we get started with today's video, I want to thank you guys for a massive amount of support you guys have been giving the channel lately. Like, literally, you guys have been watching every single video on the channel, you guys have been leaving mad support, and I think today's the day that I think we can up the like goal up a notch now today for today's awesome video because i honestly do believe you guys will love it you guys have been doing massively amazing on the support on this channel guys i i kind of want to test you guys a bit so anyways hopefully you guys like tests hopefully you guys studied and hopefully you guys are ready for the biggest test of your life now can we hit nine likes on today's video now first of all i know nine likes is a huge like goal you guys probably studied the crap of how to like videos last night and you know probably some of you guys crap maybe some of you guys didn't study and are just you know naturally smart and knowing how to do that and part of you guys probably already did that because you guys you know are probably cheaters and knew about the like goal but you know Go ahead down there right now, show me what all that studying has done, smash that like button down below, crush it, completely destroy it, get a freaking textbook and slam the heck out of that like button guys completely shatter it till it is blue because I honestly do believe with the amount of love and support you guys have been giving me lately that you guys can easily pass this like goal today so anyways thank you guys so much by the way for the love and support you guys have been giving the channel lately um I'm a little bit sick today so my voice may sound a little different but I did want to make this video because this thing is honestly really dope so hopefully you guys will enjoy and let's get right into the video. So anyways guys, everything you guys will need will be underneath that like button. So when you guys are done liking that like button, obviously, because you know what else are you going to do with the like button, um, you guys can totally go down with this behavior pack. This is the rideable ender dragon behavior pack. Now, I don't know about you, but as a little kid, no, actually, when I first started playing Minecraft 2, okay, um, riding the ender dragon was one thing I thought you could do. Because as a little kid, I don't know if you guys were like, you know, maybe when you were 7, 8, 9, or I don't know, whatever age you guys were or whatever. Um, when I was a kid, I watched a show that involved dragons or something and how people like rode them. And I thought that was the coolest thing in the world. And when I first started playing Minecraft, I thought that was something you guys could do with the dragon. Was was a little bit disappointed when that was not the case. But with this add-on, guys, you guys can definitely do it yourself. So once again, let me show you guys what you guys will need. Now, the stuff in my inventory aren't, you know, really things you need, but are things that will help out the experience. Well, definitely a diamond sword and a diamond or things you need and you and i'll show you guys why in a minute but anyways um yeah so we're gonna do it two ways today because i always wanted to write it in the end but we're gonna write it in the overworld in today's video so first of all we need a dragon guys and you guys know the only way to really get a dragon in the overworld is to cheat a bit so we have our cheats on and we're gonna summon the dragon into the overworld so we're just gonna do slash summon dragon and our current position guys and this guy is just gonna fly dude he is actually gonna fly away because he knows i'm gonna ride this dude oh man oh man Look how amazing. Dude, what is he doing? What? Dude, what did you just do? What? Oh, man. Okay, so this is a perfect spot when he... Oh, oh, I was about to ride him too when he freaking flew. Okay, okay. So he's going to fly up into the air and we need to freaking chase this guy. This might be a little bit hard to do in survival, but I honestly do believe it should be possible. So, okay, this guy, this guy, this dragon over here. Oh, man, he's actually flying the heck away from me. What is going on, bro? Oh my, okay, okay, okay. We're a little bit high up in the air. We need to catch this guy. Oh, oh dude, you I saw that ride button, right? Okay, 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 okay. We need to ride you, man. Just stop running, just stop flying. Please, just stop flying. Oh my gosh, okay. Oh, there we go, there we go. Oh man, oh man, I'm a little close. Okay, gotta get close. Okay, he's gonna stop, I think. He's gonna, no, 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 come on. You gotta land and rest, dragon. Okay. Oh, I think he's doing, I think he's doing, oh, and we can write, as you guys can see, it worked. Okay, guys, now, if we go to third-person perspective, guys, the toggle perspective of this game, okay, if the game won't freeze, man, okay, so I don't know, my tablet's just been laggy lately, but check this out, boys and girls, third-person front, and, okay, we're, like, turning, but we are definitely on the dragon's back, dude, it is absolutely insane. Now, when you're in, like, okay, you can ride the dragon whenever you guys freaking want, in all honesty, because the option will just pop up out of nowhere. We're gonna go third person back, because I think this will look a lot cooler, and oh, man, we're actually, we're actually stuck underground. I don't know what's up with the dragon and why he's doing this, but we're actually just underground. But, okay, so, let me just go to first person, actually, because I think it'd just be a little bit easier to do in first person, and just a little bit easier for me, guys, but I was just gonna show you guys that, you know, it did look cool. If you guys have a diamond sword and diamond, um, thing in your inventory, and, oh, what? 
Oh, it was so dark I didn't even realize the Ender Dragon like got us to hop off. What the heck? Oh man, okay, that's that's a little disappointing. Okay, I think we should just summon another one because it literally forced us to get off. Oh man, oh man, okay, it's fine. Okay, I'll get straight to the point with this dragon though. All you guys simply need to do once you- oh, okay. I did that wrong. But all you guys need to do with at this point, guys, is just, you know, when you guys have the dragon and fly it, is have a diamond sword and a diamond in your inventory like I do. And, okay, you just, like, knocked me to the water, my man. You, no, 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 okay. You are sick. What the, what is wrong with these dragons? Okay, okay, we need to ride this guy. We need to ride this guy. Come on, come on, come on, come on. No, 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 no. What are you doing? What is he doing? What are you guys doing? What is it with dragons and going underground? Oh boy, oh boy, this isn't good. This actually is not good. What the- Okay, okay, we need to ride this guy. We need to actually ride this guy. Get me out of here. What are they- Ah. Uh, okay, okay, these guys are a little bit hard to tame, but okay, you know what? We're just gonna skip to the cool part of the video, guys. So I saw you guys- I showed you guys how you guys can just fly those and tame those, and if you guys have, like, a diamond, um- and a diamond sword and a diamond with you, they'd be a lot easier to control. I think, you know, a better way to showcase you guys is to show you guys home turf, guys. The dragons in their home turf, or at least the dragon in the home turf. So all you guys simply need to do is, okay, we're gonna go to the end here. You guys don't need to go to the end for this, but we're going to the end just because, you know, these dragons like being underground for whatever reason and we're given a command block for some reason. I don't know what's up with that. But okay, let's get the heck out of here. Alright, now and all we have to do is find the Ender Dragon, guys, okay? Now once you get to the dragon- Oh, there he is, okay, okay, can we make it- we, Can we make it to him? Oh man, oh man, okay, the cool thing about this dragon is he just won't go wherever the heck he wants. Oh boy, okay, it's gonna be hard to fly him to ride him, though. Oh my gosh. Dude, what are you doing, my man? Okay, okay. The dragon just, like, wants to do what he does. Oh wow, this is cool, like, ravine here, I guess. Okay. Like, where did he go? What? Wait, what? Dragon? Uh, where did he go? I like hear him, but oh, there he is. Okay, I thought I lost him for a sec, but all you guys need to do is get up to the dragon, just like this, guys. Okay, oh my gosh, if they just won't run away, that'd be really, really cool. Right, okay, now if you guys have the diamond sword, and for whatever reason, it'll be in the opposite direction, wherever you like face will be where the dragon will go. If you go down, he'll go down. If you go up, um, I think he'll go up, and if you hold a diamond, it'll actually force him to go faster than he usually moves, but it'll be harder to control him. So, that that's really basically all you guys need to do, guys. Like, I'll show you guys, I'll show you guys, okay? Now, I'll be, I'll show you guys in third person perspective, because it just looks so much cooler like this. Okay, drag, don't be loud, please, man. Okay, okay, there we go. As you guys can see, I don't know why it's backwards, it's how the add-on is, but you can definitely control where he goes as, you know, to where you look. The diamond will, like, make him go faster, I do believe, as you hold it down, because he will, like, just go a ton faster. But you can't really control where this guy goes after that. It's, it's just, you know, you know, yeah. But yeah, so anyways, everything you guys will need will be underneath that like button, guys. This Ender Dragon is pretty cool. Again, you guys can easily ride this thing, like, into, like, you know, um, in the, um, overworld if you guys want, but I think it'd just be cooler in the end, man. I don't know, I don't know. Oh, I have an idea, I have an idea. Okay, this would look really, really cool right now. Okay, this guy is gonna look annoying, because I don't know why this guy looks bad whenever I do this, but we're gonna drink some of this. There we go, alright. And now we're just gonna fly the dragon around. Um, once again, a little bit hard to control. But when you guys get, you know, the hang of it, 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 it becomes a lot of an easier ordeal. As you guys can see, the dragon just goes wherever I look at. It's pretty legit, guys. It's pretty awesome. I do honestly think you guys should definitely try that. Let's try to get him to that island right there. But yeah, I honestly do believe you guys should try this out. The link to this will be underneath the like button once again. If you guys want to definitely try that out, because I honestly, you know... I think you guys would definitely like this. Let's see how far we can get him. But, um, yeah, so tell me what you guys think about this awesome, awesome add-on. I did showcase it in the past, but I did want to showcase it in, like, you know, a better way in today's video, just so you guys can see. But anyways, guys, that's gonna be about it for today's video. Tell me what you guys think. Thank you guys so much for watching. See you guys in the next video. And, oh, man, he's just, like, going around and around. Okay, okay, we're just gonna make him go faster. Thank you guys so much for watching. Peace out, guys, and subscribe. Woo!